This is Glenn Benton of the Aside, and you're listening to Metal Wani. Uh, this is Dallas here for, with Metal Wani with obviously Glenn from fucking Deicide, the man, the myth, the legend. How the fuck are you doing? Good. 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 Yeah. Yeah, it's always been great. Good. Shows turnout's great. Yeah, it's been fun. All the bands, everybody gets along. It's been nice. That's, that's, you can't ask for that. Yeah, Much more than that. Been, it, I haven't done a tour this smooth, uh, I don't think ever. Yeah? Yeah, it's been, yeah. Yeah, I mean, we, we we get some stories every now and again from those busted up tours that don't go quite as smooth. Right. Uh, well, <laughs> shit happens, man. You know. Yeah. There's uh, you know, there's always that one uh, particular problem. So, <laughs> yeah. But, no, those tours been smooth, man. I can't believe. It. Yeah. Going by quick. So, what do you think of the rest of the bands? I mean, oh, you got great, quite man. a lineup, and they're all good guys too, man. You know. Yeah. You know, it's like everybody's been very considerate of each other, and it's been nice. That's pretty sweet. Yeah. So, who's your favorite to watch then? Or do you watch them? Or? Oh man, it's like this time of night, I'm usually <laughs> topping a few seats before I go on, so I'm fresh, you know. Fair enough. So, so I, um, yeah, the Inquisition guys are really fucking, they're, they're good, man. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. So now. I, you, I usually catch their set and set thing, and then, you know, before we go on. Fair enough. That's still a pretty good amount of time. Right. Yeah. I'm trying to do that for all the bands out check I mean, everybody's great. Yeah. So now, how long have you been touring? On this tour so far? Or no, like... How many years? Total, yeah, how many oh, years? Fuck, 30 years. <laughs> yeah, well, it's 1990. Jeez. Yeah, since before Early me. 1980, <laughs> yeah, no, 89, 90 is when we started. So, obviously a lot of tours in, in that time. Yeah, so, the, so, aside from this one, what have you been some not- notable tours amidst that stretch? Oh, man, I mean, we've played with... <laughs> Play with a lot of different bands, man. But um, um, I I would say there was some tours back in the late '90s, you know, like '90s, '96, '97, '98, right around in there that were pretty out of control. Yeah. yeah. Like good out of control or? Um, just crazy. You know. Okay. You know, things were you know at a, a, at a pinnacle point where <laughs> everybody was just you know doing crazy shit. I don't know, really, you know. <laughs> yeah. So you came out within the minds of evil. Was it late last year? Uh, yeah, something like that. Yeah, so how do you feel that stacks up compared to the, the rest of your discography? Oh, uh, I think it's, man, I think it's only getting better, man, from here. You know, it's like with Kevin in the band now, it's really super tight. Yeah. We don't have an issue with, you know, that, that, that side of the stage anymore, so. That's good. The place is filled, and, uh, yeah, man, from what, you know, from the response, you know, you used to be able to gauge an album by how many you sold, but now yeah. it's how many hits you get on YouTube, you know what I mean? So, <laughs> as far as hits on YouTube, we're doing pretty good. Good. Yeah, you can't really track pirating, unfortunately. Yeah, yeah it's done. <laughs> this album got stolen this many times. Yeah. <laughs> or this turrets, you know, and that yeah. turret. I just can't keep up. I don't even give a shit. <laughs> so, let's see. Um, where do you go from here, then? I mean, you got uh, we'll tours. Go city. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> right. Where do you go after the tour, then, with the band? Um, going home, going to take a few weeks off, and we're going to Europe for a month. Nice. Who's that with? Uh, massive music, uh, Vader management. Oh, okay. So, all right. Now I'm kind of a giant gear nerd, right. and I love I love all sorts of gear. But um, could you break down your live rig, like from guitar to cab? And um, I've got two. Uh, I've got two uh, custom uh, Ibanez um, destroyer bases, uh, four strings. I have um, uh, I have four Harky cabs. I have two four tens, two fifteens. I got two LH1000 Harky power amps with a run into a uh, Sam's amp rack preamp. And, um, yeah, that makes some noise. Yeah, that's a lot of power. Yeah. So, what, le- what led you to Harky and Ibanez? Just, um, I, it was like Harky, getting hold of Harky, man, it was just kind of like a fluke because I was uh, in the process of buying a subwoofer and it was a Samson subwoofer and it came to my house destroyed when they delivered it, so I sent it back and then. I figured, you know what, uh, let me just call Samson and see, you know, and talk to uh, the rep, Evan, and the rest is history. Yeah. So, there's a lot of crazy new material coming out and a lot of amazing albums. What are what are you listening to right now? 
man, I really, I, I, I'm <laughs> not doing this, man. I really don't listen to much, you know, except yeah. for old metal and stuff like that. But when I do, you know, I, I ride a bike, my bicycle every morning, you know, for exercise. And I, I usually listen, I listen to everything, man. You know. Well, so what's your what's your uh, bike playlist? Oh God, man. <laughs> um, I usually listen to this, you know, like get myself ready for a tour. I'll listen to the set. I'll put it in a playlist or whatever. Hmm. But um, yeah, you know, just to refresh my memory and. But I mean, I listen to everything, man. You know, <laughs> I, just, I, I, I listen to like a huge range of music, man, from classic rock to you know British invasion stuff to the stuff. You know, I mean, all the way through, man. You know, all the way into metal yeah. and I just listen to everything. Hey, fair enough. I just don't listen to rap and Lady Gaga. And <laughs> no, no. Glenn no, Benton no. listens no. to Lady Gaga. Nope. We're using that as a headline now. Oh, God, please don't. <laughs> God, pancake tits. <laughs> Oh, right. that'd be nuts. So, all right. Well, I love the tattoo work you got. That's I mean, old school. I've, it is old school. My buddy Vinny Days, Vinny Silvatano, used to be the drummer for the Demolition Hammer back in the day. Right. That's who did all my tats. He used to travel nice. with us. So, and that was like going back to the tours, you know, 95, 6, 7, 8, you know. Yeah. He was on those tours with me, and we had a lot of good time. Oh, yeah. So, which piece is your favorite? Oh, man. I, I don't know, man. I got... A lot of disappearing ink. I mean, I got some <laughs> on my chest too, and I think my oh, wow. Jesus right there. That's is, that's a classic. Yeah. So. <laughs> yeah, man. Shit, you do when you're younger. <laughs> I hear you. Yeah. Got, got a bunch of holes all in my body. Yeah. And piercings and. Yeah, man. So. Well, hey. Well, again. <laughs> Sorry, uh, I'm exhausted, man. But, <laughs> you're good. Yeah, hey. man. Uh, well, I appreciate you taking the time uh, no before problem. your nap to no you know problem. come sit down and chat with me. Anybody you want to yell at? Shout out. Piss off Christians. What do you want to um, <laughs> Just fuck off everybody. <laughs> Can't say any more than that. Awesome, brother. All right.